everybody. <clears throat> so, uh, it's been about, let's see, we sprayed on the 15th, and today is the 21st, so it's been about, this is, will be the sixth day. Um, for about three days, it didn't look like anything was going to be uh, dying. All the uh, water mill was still pretty green. <clears throat> so, yesterday it started uh, turning white and turning a different color and uh, so it is now the morning today is uh, Wednesday morning and so it's been today will be the sixth day and just wanted to let you guys know and see what it looks like <clears throat> also I'm uh, trying out the new GoPro still getting used to it but um, make it a lot easier to shoot videos using this thing so anyway uh, that's what it looks like I'm gonna do a little bit of fishing uh, the fish have been biting a lot but I don't think I don't know if they're gonna bite too much today considering that last night it got down in the 30s it, the low was about 38 so um, so the fish will probably not be biting near as much, but sometimes you just never know. But uh, yeah, that's kind of what it looks like. Um, so I'm just going to throw a few out, see what, see what happens. <clears throat> sometimes I have a few fish in this little, this little enclosure here. Because I set up a... Um, little light there it's one of those uh, neon lights and <coughs> excuse me I can't clear my throat today um, it's a neon light and it probably attracts some fish and sometimes I get a little brim and I'm hoping that the crappie will start coming in here and feeding on minnows and stuff by that light so that's that's what I'm doing right now is doing a little bit of crappie fishing but uh, like I said it got really cold so it's possible that they may have moved back into the, the deeper water today so <clears throat> anyway um, it does I think that it's gonna look a lot better once all this dies and and sinks down some of it is, um, there's a lot of this green algae, if you can see that, it's right there. That's algae, so it's not that stuff, but if you look, <coughs> there's some, uh, there's a lot of that uh, water mill that's turned white, or like a, a light brown. Probably, a, it's more, more white or like a grayish color. <clears throat> but um oh yeah, it felt like I had a bite unless it felt like something grabbed it right there um but yeah they uh there's a lot of that uh, water mill that's dying off but that that algae is not dying and uh, we've also got a bunch of white stuff that fell out of the trees like a uh, like a cotton type stuff I don't know what that is I think it comes out of those willow trees but so that's but there's still a lot of that <clears throat> water mill that that has died off so this is month two of the spring so we're gonna we're gonna do this again um, May 15th and usually by the the last day of the of that month it start it's pretty much coming back pretty strong but it was it was very um, it was very overdue as far as uh, needing to spray because that stuff was starting to get pretty strong uh, pretty thick in here <clears throat> as you can see there was a pretty good amount of it but um, still you've got a pretty good area uh, over there that's pretty clear so Anyway, that's uh, that's what's going on now, and I'll probably do a little bit more fishing. 
and see if um, see if anything will bite. I've got some some worms. I've got a little worm farm <coughs> that um, that I'm now able to get a few worms. So I'm going to try the uh, bluegill and see if they might be biting as well. Yeah, these fish have got to be pretty confused right now because uh, yesterday was in the 80s and today or this morning it was 38 so they were uh, they were actually starting to to bed up the uh, the bluegill were starting to bed up along this bank here and uh, now they're probably like what is going on so try a little bit of try a little bit of fishing and I uh, just wanted to give you guys that that update and um, also try out the new <coughs> camera see how it how it's coming out aim it down so we can so you can see see my bobber and the plan is once it all dies off in here I'm gonna take this little scooper this little net that I've got <clears throat> and clean it out and that way I can keep this all clean but for now it's uh, it's pretty it, it's pretty dirty in there but um, <clears throat> over there it looks pretty good gonna try throwing out that way see if something might go after it using a little uh, black and chartreuse jig sometimes they go after that color I had gotten away from it I had gotten more into the natural colors like minnow colors <clears throat> and I hadn't really used a, a black and chartreuse in a while so just trying trying something different what it's all about right so that is where we are at for now and I'm gonna go ahead and sign off and maybe try a little bit more on the other side of the pond over there so uh, thanks for watching guys